Something up here I gotta show you folks. All right, so we've done well, we'll get back this far. So I'm into the trees and the snow is definitely not as deep. And I came on this. No idea what kind of bird that was. It sure wasn't a turkey. But boy. Something really cleaned it up. And this is fairly fresh. All right, folks, we are back with the uh, ATV. And as you can see, I've gotten quite a bit farther along than where I have stopped. But this is where we're gonna park the ATV for the time being. And we're going to put our backpack on with the uh, trail cameras in it and put some snowshoes on. And we're going to go for a little bit of a hike, check for uh, trails and get our cameras back in place. All right, let's get set up and ready to go. I, I'd, I like these snowshoes because of the giant ice cleats on the bottom. So they are just perfect for uh, this kind of condition. So we'll finish getting set up here and head out. All right, folks, we are all set up. Let's head to our first location. You can, you can see all the tracks here. There's so many of them. And these big ones are from the last time I was back in here to pick up the cameras. But the problem I have with this location is the amount of turkey traffic through here. It is just unbelievable. I'll get hundreds of video clips of turkeys as they come back through here. So there is my uh, holder right there. So we're going to pull that out, take it with us and see if we can find a spot where there is tracks with a little less of the turkeys. <laughs> Sorry, turkeys, but you're getting tiresome. All right, we're just coming out of the bush here and coming up to our campsite, our future campsite. Very few tracks through here. It's clear overhead, which means there's a lot of snow here. There's my gear box and table and chair back in there. And you can see my tire tracks over there. That's as far as I came in. It's just too deep here. And as of yet, I don't want to bring the tractor back through there to get to this because it would just be too tippy. All right, let's keep going. So this is the stream coming downhill here that goes down to the part of the trail where we were working to put our pipe in to help deal with the flooding. I kind of thought there might have been some tracks around here, but there's absolutely none. All right, we need to get up this hill to where I'm going to uh, put one of the cameras. So let's get moving up there. Pretty clear signs of deer going through there and filling one of my old footprints here. <laughs> We're just about back to the point where I want to put that other camera. 
So there's some deer and coyote tracks coming right through here. And this is a tough slog to get out here and deal with this, but you do see all the tracks and that really helps for a decent placement of the trail cameras. So let's get back in here Okay, yeah, this is still a really good spot. And this is where I thought I saw potential bear tracks, but the camera was in the wrong mode. So the only thing we captured was the butt of something. And there's just no way to confirm for sure what it was. Okay, so this is still looking like a really good spot. There's the bracket there. All right, let's get the uh, backpack off and we'll get one camera in place here. Okay, there is one camera in place. What? Do you guys see that? Let's, uh, let's have a look here. What do we got? Oh boy. <laughs> Holy mackerel. Yeah. Clearly a turkey. And clearly it did not survive the encounter. Boy, isn't that interesting? Okay, maybe we'll collect a few feathers here uh, from this and then we'll move on. I'm thinking down this way as there is a real steady trail coming back here. Well, we'll grab these and get the uh, backpack and we'll uh, head back along here a little bit farther and see if there is a spot that looks interesting. As I see a few crisscross trails here. Okay, this looks like really good potential here. I don't really see much in the way of turkey tracks, but the turkeys seem to split off and head in this direction on a different trail. So I think maybe we'll give this a try. We're going to uh, get our camera mount out and install it in this tree right here. I should have brought a machete with me. There's a lot of potential trails right here. I want to make sure they have a clear path to go by the camera so they can get fairly close to it. But what is this trail? Well, that's interesting. There's a trail right over here that are human tracks. What on earth would somebody be doing way back in here? And who would it be? As it looks like they came back when the snow was quite deep. Well, let's get this one in place. Okay, that should be a good angle, I think. I'm going to have to upgrade these cameras. 
because all three of them are 1080p and I'd like to get a higher resolution camera. All right, that should be pretty good. Let's activate this one. All right, there we are. Well, it's been a bit of a slog, but, I, but we're doing pretty good. Okay, we got one more to set. And we might redo that location too, because there wasn't that many clips on it this last time. All right, let's, uh, let's head for that location. All right, another peek at our drainage here. So far, so good. Nothing's washed out, but something, don't know what those black prints are. Little, little paw prints from something down in the water here. They're quite small and obviously light. They didn't sink in. All right, let's keep moving along. And there are no tracks back here. Yeah, this is going to be a fun part to deal with. Whew, boy. There's a lot of water coming down here. I got to figure out a way to channel it across and temporarily uh, kiss off that trail and get all the melt coming down here and in. And isn't that strange? I'm spotting a camera. It isn't mine. Oh, that'll be Sam's. Let's go wave at Sam's camera. Well, we are partway up Dragon's Back Hill, about halfway. And this looks like a really, really good spot here. Yeah. That is quite a hill there that they've been going up and down, but they're definitely traveling. So we've got our spot for our last camera. All right, let's get the mount in and get the camera set up. Then I need a little something to wet my whistle. Oh, this, this looks like a really good spot. Yeah, I'm very happy with this one. Oh, there we go. Okay. So you can see that trail coming over the hill there. It seems to be a pretty odd spot, but nonetheless, okay, let's start hiking back to the ATV, back down Dragon's Back Hill. All right, folks, we are just about out. So we've got our three cameras placed. We've got one halfway up Dragon's Back Hill, and we've got two more back behind the campsite. So that's good. Looks like very good locations for them. And boy, <laughs> it was a slog coming out here in this deep, wet snow. Definitely would not have wanted to uh, do this much walking around without the snowshoes. But it was fun. I love being outdoors every time it's an adventure. So if you've been enjoying the video, please don't forget to give it a like. And I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. So be safe out there, be good to each other, and we'll see you out on the trails the next time. Oh yeah. I can feel that mug in my hand already.